So thanks to Stu for the first six races, it's the HF Mares Novices Hurdle. Next to this is over two miles, and the top one is Isnalos for Darren Thompson. Sir Michael Kane, Paul Rhodes, a serious ally for T. Rogers Supernova. Craig Beck with Ward Clock Deal, Derek Hinton, West Leak, Ryan Costello, Carbon Neutral for Graham Clitterbock, Carmania, Martin Needham, Cleopatra for Paul O'Neill. Going to be all white, Josh Russell and Social Butterfly, T. Rogers and Tin Turn Breda for Leon Van Rensburg. So 12 of them then facing the starter and away they go. By that little house and Cleopatra is just about the first to show, but Water Clock Deal coming up on the outside to dispute that lead now as they cross that little pathway and make their way down towards the first of the seven flights that they'll take in this race. And Cleopatra and Water Clock Deal get to that first flight in the lead and they skip over it nicely about three lengths ahead of the rest of the field as they come past the stand past the winning post and swing right-handed for another circuit and it's Cleopatra in the green sleeves on the outside just in the lead of water clock in the pink and a gap of about four lengths now to Sir Michael Kane in third the impression this was a Phillies race. I don't know if so Michael Kane is a Philly. But, uh, just have a look at that later on. Carmania at the back marker at this early stage as they come down to flight three. And Water Clock Deal has gone on there from Cleopatra in second. Gap back to Sir Michael Kane in third. Then West Leak is four and his now Ozzy is five. And Osiria Sara after that one. With Carbon Neutral and Social Butterfly next. Tintern Brader and Carmania are still the back two. Got water clock deal and Cleopatra is still the front two. We've got a mile and a quarter still to go. And racing down towards the next flight. Downhill run to this one. And Cleopatra on the outside. Water clock deal on the near side. Water clock deal jumping it just the better. There's still a good four lengths clear of Sir Michael Kane who's back in third. Supernova has now dropped out to the back. It's just coming down towards the midway point in the race now then. Got three more flights to take. And Cleopatra on the outside, just about in front. Water clock deal in second. Gap of only three now to Sir Michael Kane as they take that third last. And this time Cleopatra jumped it best down. We lost from the back. Carmania's gone. So Carmania are crashing fall over the hurdles there. Going to be all white is making a forward move now into fourth. But they're making their way towards the second last flight now. And Cleopatra's in the lead from Water clock deal in second. And Sir Michael Kane is third. Going to be all white is fourth. Then he's Delos Carbon Neutral. Tinter and Breda trying to get into it. So Butterflies going wide, then Supernova. A serious side on a gap back to West Leak, who's the back marker of those that remain. But Water Clock Deal and Cleopatra are still having a ding dong battle for the lead with Sir Michael Kane and going to be all white looming behind. Also running on now is Carbon Neutral. Tin Turn Breda is getting closer and isn't the lot is going the shortest way around. They've got just over four furlongs to race. Racing down towards the second last flight, then now and Cleopatra is in the lead by about a length. But going to be all white is thrown out a big challenge on the outside. Water Clock Deal looks like it might have run its race but it's Cleopatra in the lead from going to be all white and Sir Michael Kane. Here comes and Tin Turn Breda on the outside. Then as they race down towards now this second last flight, and it's still Cleopatra over the second last the slow drum by the leader. And Tin Turn Breda takes it up on the outside. And here comes Carbon Neutral as well. And also bursting through is Isnalos. The race has completely changed as they come down towards the final flight. Tin Turn Breda's in the lead from Carbon Neutral and Isnalos. Isnalos looks a big danger as they come down to this final flight. Then there it's Isnalos on the outside. Tin Turn Breda on the inside. Shortly between these two. Two. Over the final flight they go. Better jump by Tinto and Breda. And Tinto and Breda begins to pull away. Social Butterfly fell at last. He's the last. Now he's fighting back. It's going to be close. Tinto and Breda and he's the last. It's going to be on the middle. They race up towards the run. Tinto and Breda and he's the last. I can't split them. Going to be all white was probably third. Supernova ran on really well. Westlake was pulled up. Social Butterfly crashed down at the final flight. But that is mighty close. Uh, maybe just Leon's horse has taken it. Tinto and Breda. But he's the last. Battled back really gamely. Let's take a look and see. It's a short head win for Tintern Breda for Leon Van Rensburg. Isnalos for Darren Thompson. Another lucky second. Supernova for Craig Beckwith. Went on really well to be third. Going to be all white fourth for Joshua Sutherland. And Sir Michael Kane fifth for Paul Rhodes. Now, I was under the impression that was a mare's novice's hurdle. And Tintern Breda is a mare that's won it. But the second and third and the fifth, the sixth and the ninth were all cold. So, technically speaking, might have to be disqualified.